The sweetest poison. Death on your tongue. No. It's not cigarette smoke. It's not marijuana. It's definitely not alcohol. So, what is it? It is processed sugar. There are different types of processed sugar, e.g. Brown sugar, white, refined sugar, industrial sugar, synthetic sugar. Brown sugar is normally used to add flavor to desserts and baked goods. White, refined sugar, however, is used in many foods e.g. Foods that require rising, e.g. Meringues mousses and souffles. It is also used to sweeten beverages like tea or coffee. It is also added to savory dishes. Industrial sugar is used in soft drinks, canned and bottled products, dairy products, processed foods, confectionery, and baking. Artificial or synthetic sugar is used in beverages, dietary products, drugs, and mouthwashes. When it comes to Coke, as a general rule, there's around 10.6 g of refined sugar per 100 milliliters. This means that a 330 milliliters can contains around 39 g, which is about 9 teaspoons of sugar. A 500 milliliters bottle, therefore, contains more than 50 g of sugar and over 12 teaspoons. Ellen White wrote about processed sugar in several of her books. In one of her books entitled Testimonies for the Church Volume 2 page 230 she says, sugar clogs the system. It hinders the working of the living machine. Rich, highly sweetened foods are more readily available than ever before. Arrays of candy, cookies, donuts, ice cream, and other sugar-laden treats seem to greet us on every hand. So, what follows the taste? Obesity A sweet moment on the lips adds padding to the hips. Since obesity leads to a number of chronic diseases, its rise will likely bring higher rates of metabolic syndrome, diabetes, heart disease, arthritis, and some cancers, among other adverse physiological conditions. Ellen White, in her book called Councils on Diet and Foods, on page 328 tells us, anything that hinders the active motion of the living machinery affects the brain very directly. And from the light given me, sugar, when largely used, is more injurious than meat. So, how do free forms of sugar contribute to excess weight? Processed sugar offers no nutritional value. It contains empty calories and stimulates the production of a harmful form of fat called triglycerides. These molecules are generally formed in your liver and can be deposited around the waist, visceral fat, thus leading to weight gain. Refined sugar also contributes to malnutrition. How? The more sugary foods a person eats, the less appetite and room tends to be left in the diet for more healthful foods. Also, certain nutrients and vitamins are necessary for digestion. Since refined sugar does not supply the needed elements, the body needs to draw on its reserves of these nutrients. Over time, if a person continues to eat too much refined sugar, the demand will exceed the supply, and mineral and vitamin deficiencies can result. Another well-known effect of generous refined sugar intake is that of compromised immune function. More people get sick during the holiday season. Why? The body's bacteria-fighting white blood cells become increasingly sluggish and impotent in proportion to the amount of sugar eaten. Refined sugar also promotes inflammation in the body. When eaten in large quantities, it is actually more harmful than meat, which is a major cause of inflammation. Researchers found that excess table sugar added to the diet of mice significantly reduced the beneficial anti-inflammatory properties of omega-3 fats. This points out that too much refined sugar in the diet, even if accompanied by healthful foods, can be harmful. Thank the Lord, however, that there are alternatives to this dangerous yet popular additive. Honey Dates Coconut sugar Sugar cane bananas and stevia. A good way to stop sugar addiction is to stop snacking. Finally, the Lord tells us that we should present our bodies as a living sacrifice, holy, and acceptable to God.
In 1 Corinthians 10 verse 31, the Bible says, Whether therefore ye eat, or drink, or whatsoever ye do, do all to the glory of God. Let's take sugar off our tables and put one or more of these alternatives and you will see amazing results. This video is produced by Eden Stream Ministries.